Good day guys, Bing here. Um, so we have another tricky one. <laughs> yeah, tri tricky to um, model in Revit, I think. Um, but still we can. Um, so this is this is uh, what I did. Um, not perfect, but it's doable using um, just, you know, spline through points so you can see that's a spline through points and with some uh, profiles on this spline and then we try to um, somehow adjust the spline to achieve this path and then also we will need to adjust the profiles and uh, to to achieve this um, okay so let's try uh, so this is a conceptual mass. Um, let's uh, do it. You can, of course, you can do a modeling place mass. You can even, um, uh, probably not adaptive family. <laughs> so let's just uh, use a conceptual mass for this one. Okay. So, so first we need to. So you can see here. So we maybe this is a top view, right? So we can place maybe just place some uh, points um, along this so of course uh, when we place this uh, we can do it in 3d view or in a floor plan and then we can actually we can just directly directly uh, do a reference spline through points okay so uh, and let me, let me have a look another look so go this <laughs> Okay, so something like this. I'll just add. Uh, hang on, I need to have another look. Okay, go up and down. And that's it. Okay, so uh, let's go to 3D view. Of course, currently they are flat, so we need to. Okay, so this go up, and this will be the lower point. Go up again, so lower point again so we can go maybe this go up come down this this point maybe in the middle so this will be the lower point and this will go up again so I'll just move this up go this go up and uh, uh, maybe we don't need that many points so I'll delete one so you can also add where if you uh, think that, uh, uh, you, you need more so and also we might need to you know adjust this a little bit um yeah maybe this need to go up maybe this need to go up a little bit more yeah. and i'll just uh, probably don't spend too much time because you don't know the uh, we don't know the result without any profile so um, uh maybe just don't need this one uh, maybe we need it just control z so okay maybe i'll stop here um, and i uh, think we can start to play some uh, profiles okay so for profiles i'll just place a point you draw on face onto this reference line so first i'll place a profile here so um i'll just use the reference line draw a, a line Draw our plan, set to a plan, play, pick this point, and then we can just draw a horizontal, maybe just horizontal line here. Maybe just drag. So this one will be will be huge, right? So and this is it. So if if I select the profile in the path and create a form, you will see. Okay, so we can't even create it. So that's fine. Um, so this is because the you know all the the relationship between the you know the path and the, the profile so the the or the curvature of this you know reference line so it's not yeah so at least see we can create it but the the so we can see the profile we, we, we want to rotate this one here so we don't want to um we yeah so which means we we need to adjust the the angle of the profile so so uh, we can't achieve uh, the result with only one so we need more so let's just delete it okay so 
then uh, we can I'll copy some more okay so and uh, create oh hell sorry wrong one uh, pick new host pick new host so what I'm going to do is I'll place this just evenly so for example I'll place one here and pick new host and then maybe I'll just pay place one uh, at point two all right so and then place this one at point four and place another one pick new host and place it uh, at point six and so this one will be point eight okay so point eight and then la last one will be one so we need to copy another one so let's just cc copy and pick new host place it and uh, type in one now we have all the profiles but if i select all these um, profiles together with this part i will create exactly the same shape uh, we did with one so you can see exactly the same so what we need to do now is we need to rotate each probably keep the first one and the second one we want it to, to rotate uh, I think clockwise so we need to pick the point right so and then rotate this one so for example 10 degrees so you can see rotate a little bit 20 degrees a little bit and maybe uh, okay so this one uh yeah not sure 30 degree and then for this one we need to we should not come down maybe rotate uh uh yeah counterclockwise and yeah i'm not quite sure actually six degree to oh negative 60 oh pro, I, I don't know <laughs> 60 let's try 60 yeah i think that's that's more about it see 120 degree okay so I think yeah this looks better but uh, still not not perfect so you can see uh, some of the so looks like a bit wider here mm, not yeah I guess we need to rotate this one as well so 20 degree or even just you know you can still adjust we can still adjust the you know these points to change the shape the overall path right so this to control the path this control the the um go up a little bit go up a little bit yeah so this might we need to rotate this one so 10 degrees yeah not quite right but yeah so i think you just need a time right so it's just need a time to adjust all these so maybe this one needs to go yeah a little bit hard to pick so let's use wf wireframe so it's easier to you know select all these points right so this oh there are two points there one is the one to control the path the other one is the the one we have you know profiles profile on and rotate 20 degree yeah actually i'm not quite sure <laughs> 100 degree anyway so let's let's continue so here so you can see it go if i'll change it to sd shade go down here so it looks like we need to rotate this one by don't know why 80 degree maybe yeah that's better and then the last uh, not last one uh, this is the second last this last ones here maybe I'll drag it back a little bit so it's easier to pick um, yeah don't know 20 270 no 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 too much 180 again yeah okay so this is not too bad actually let me just delete this one some oh okay that's fine so maybe i'll just rot move this up a little bit and then try to delete it yeah, still don't work uh let's just keep it maybe i'll drag this one to the end um looks like i think we more need to move this point a little bit move this a little bit uh yeah not 
So need so need to be flat here. So I guess how do we do it? <laughs> so maybe just trying to rotate the, these profiles. So for example, this one I'll do one 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 ten. Yeah, close enough. And this one maybe try a uh, thirty degree, forty. Yeah, better. Maybe looks if I go to elevation okay so this bit is a bit too low so I think we need to we can try to uh, that's another point there yeah so that's what this is one of the points we have another point here to control wireframe WF and try to or we can actually or if I delete it yeah I think that works so sometimes not always okay so not always you know more points is better sometimes less points better uh, <laughs> so this looks like you go up a little bit uh, maybe you need to rotate this one a little maybe this one need to 20 degree reduce yeah so that's better uh, this need to go up a little bit more so as you can say it's just you know trying to adjust all the points to you know to make it more um, natural I mean like uh, yeah so so each of these bigger points they control the shape of the overall um, path and the little one control the rotation of the profile so because sometimes you just need to you know try to find the the best you know just feel <laughs> feel best I mean yeah so it looks more natural I guess mm, maybe yeah this one looks like okay we need we might need to rotate this a little bit I don't know which side actually yeah so maybe 200 will be fine 195 so just make it flat um, I think that this is all about it I'll try to delete a point here yeah it works and maybe just drag it back a little bit so mm, yeah looks like oh, we need to uh, maybe move this point to the right to make it more like a straight um, at this end it looks like we need to rotate this a little bit more or less 190 oops what's going on 190 oh no 193 yeah okay so this one need to adjust so yeah a bit like back and forth to achieve the best outcome right so uh, this is you know lower we might need to lift this bit a little bit so at least this is flat um, yeah I think it's okay looks good right yeah of course um, it can be tricky so um, if when if, if you want to you know adjust the the size because uh, because there's no easy way but you can't just you know scale scale the uh, a spline through points you can't so um, yeah just need to uh, decide decide the size first like or uh, you know like roughly or the overall size when you first create this spline through points it's just roughly on the uh, um, plan plan uh, just have that planned so you don't need to do, you know uh, trying to adjust the shape uh, adjust the size because it's 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 very hard to you know keep the keep the shape so you might think oh this is very good uh, shape but uh, it would be very hard if you wanted to change the size yeah I think this one's it that is it's good, not too bad right so, Oh, better control Z. So, looks like yeah. Every time you change a little thing, you need to go back to change a lot of thing like all the angles of the profiles. But I think this one's good. Um, and then 
you can uh, I'm not sure what you're going to use this for but uh, it can be a you know landscape uh, like like a sculpt sculpture um, what can we do with this one so you can somehow you can like use devoted surface you can place something like a, a, a like framings you can use maybe you can just you know do all these uh, apply those uh, patterns to it for example so like um, maybe 30 yeah so just do some interesting thing you can create some interesting thing using this right so okay so I think I'll leave it to you so yep yeah, so basically this is it so how um, to do it um, so we can just create a spline through point adjust the you know the 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 points the the elevation of points um, um, roughly and uh, and then apply some uh, place some profiles onto them and then create create um, create a, a form right so and then just try to rotate those profile to achieve this so this is it uh, if you uh, I, I will up, upload this so you can have a play and also just remember you can also change the size for example oh, this bit looks like a why well, it's a little bit small so we can just increase the size here All right so that's uh, so yeah so you can just adjust the size uh, just pick the lines and then you can, you can adjust the size okay so that's all um, yeah thanks for watching and I'll see you next time thank you Bye.